Alright, back with 41 health. That's pretty respectable considering how the maximum you can get is 55, I think it was? Something like that. Pretty high. But yeah, that, just that alone should tell you how close we are to beating this. Cave story is pretty short, I'm sorry. Ooh, ouch. Sorry to say. But we still got a bit left to go. And seriously, the last level of this game just has so much replay value. Ah! I'm being attacked by four swords! Why do you throw swords? Where do you keep them? Just really be careful. You have so much stuff flying at you from everywhere that you can lose track of some... Okay, more missiles. Yay. Let's fire them. You aren't dead yet? There we go. No! No! That's my health! I'm gonna lose more health trying to grab that health than I am going to get that health in the first place. Close jump. Made it. Good. More health. Yay! Got it! Missiles... Ah. Let's get our blue, our fireball out. Just go for it. Go, 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 go. Yes. Oh. This is the closest thing and closest. Yeah, you can call to a recharge station. Oh, there's health up there. Let's go grab it. Health! Yay! Ah, I fell. More health? Yes, more health. More health! No, experience. Health? Ah, whatever. Health! Yay! Alright, these guys. Not sure what to call them, other than annoying. Or fragile. Dun, 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 dun. This level, um, yeah, it is definitely is Labyrinth 3. This is so much fun on the inner and the enemy rush part of the game. Well, except that it's not in this game, it's a fan made version of this game. Still, it's incredibly fun. Come on. And it'd be a lot easier if I had either the machine gun, which Curly has, or if I had the booster point 8. But we're saving. We're gonna get some even better weapons later on down the road. And there are some pretty precise jumps that you have to make in this part. Come on. No, die. And Curly, you are of no help at all. You are worthless. Yay. In fact, a shield right there. Ow. And we're back at full health. Yeah, I'll let you survive. Press it. Always press mysterious buttons. That teleporter. Whoa. That teleporter will take you back. Um, if you have a booster point eight, then you'll be able to use that teleporter so that you can go and save at this point. If you don't have the Rooster Point 8, though, it will be absolutely worthless, as you'll just have to fight your way all the way back here. Since the save point is below... Let's see... Blade. No, that's not the blade, that's the blade. There we go. Ah, level down. Level up! The blade just requires so little experience to level up and down that... Well, it can be incredibly frustrating. And also incredibly useful. I said the word incredibly a lot, don't I? Anyways, this is really the make or break point of the game. Well, not this room, but the next room. Because this is where Curly can actually die. Yeah, I'll just let you process that for a little bit. to open all these doors so that you can get into the next area. This one's 
suck, so just bash it with whatever you have. There we go. You hear something give. And this last one, you gotta go to this terminal down there. Well, if you don't know what to do, then you can just talk to Curly. She'll give you some hints. Some suggestions, really. Because she doesn't know what to do any more than you do. And this is where something that was just a curiosity in early parts of the game gives it actual meaning. Quote has an air meter. If he runs out of air, he will die. You're not all too concerned about that in earlier levels. But here, when the boss you're fighting... How is that fireball we're even working underwater anyway? When the boss that you're fighting can raise and lower the water level at will? He'll be more concerned about just breathing than he will actually fighting the boss. Anyways, this is an extremely important part of the game. You ignore Curly for now, go over here and grab this shiny thing. Shiny things are also a good thing to grab in games. And that's the tow rope. We'll find out what the tow rope is used for pretty darn soon, but just a sec. Okay, still got plenty of time to beat this. I should really start clocking my time so that I don't have to keep interrupting my gameplay. Ah, whatever. This is the first boss that will actually pose a challenge to you. Because it'll blow you away all the time. And, well, it takes a lot of damage before dying. Plus, your missiles are pretty ineffective because... You're gonna want your blade. Your missiles are ineffective because of all the stuff that it'll shoot out at you. Ah, there goes the blade. And because you have to climb up to actually get to the boss every single time that you fall. And you'll be falling a lot. You'll be falling even before you get up there. Yeah, but Curly is pretty useful when it comes to this fight. Because she can actually do some damage while you're trying to get back onto the stage. Ah, darn it. I hate level 3 blade because... Oh, I need to get back up. I'm losing air. I'm losing air. I'm gonna die. I'm going to die. Get back higher up. Higher, 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 higher. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Jump! Oh, barely survived. That was close. That was close as possible to get. Come on, open up, open up your eyes so I can kill you. What's the deal with attacking eyes in video games anyway? I can't, I still can't believe I survived that last one. And you'll also notice that if you approach him, that he'll slowly back away. Or... Oh, come on. Yes, okay, there we go. Thanks, Charlie. You took care of him. It's really annoying how everyone else can stand on those broken beams except for you. Alright, well, it's time to stand pointlessly around while my air runs out. Curly, however, she has the air tank, so yeah, she's good. She is totally good. We're not playing this Curly, though, we're playing this quote. Dead. The sense is dim and the will grows dark. Did you know that which woman Janko once had a brother? His name was Balos. Like his sister, he wielded powers far beyond those mortals. You can breathe. 
Curly sacrifices herself to save you. And that's the end of this video, so I'll show you what to do next on the next one. Here we are again, nothing's happened. I'm just, you just need to talk to Curly. He's not moving, but it looks like he's still alive. And that's what the tow rope's for. You need to attach the tow rope to her so that you can carry her out. You can leave her in there, but that'll give you the bad, well, it's not the bad ending, but the normal ending. It'll also force you to see her just lying in there while the world explodes.